Welcome to ClickMyProjects.com. This video demonstrates a blood vessel extraction technique in retinal images titled Gabba Wavelet Based Blood Vessel Segmentation in Retinal Images Using Kernel Classifiers. Retina is an important field in the medical treatment of pathologies. Segmentation of the vasculature in retinal fundus images plays an important role in the diagnosis of many eye diseases such as hypertension, arteriosclerosis and blindness caused by diabetes. In this paper, we propose a comparison of kernel classifiers for the vessel segmentation. Kernel based classifier such as support vector machine and relevance vector machine is used to segment the vessels by classifying each pixel as vessel or non-vessel based on the pixels feature vector. The main steps in this paper are green channel extraction, green channel inversion, GABA wavelet transform, SVM segmentation, RVM segmentation and a performance calculation to analyze the segmentation of SVM and RVM in terms of specificity, sensitivity and accuracy. The flow of the project starts with green channel extraction. Green channel extraction means extracting the red, green and blue components from the input image selected. Green channel is extracted because it shows best vessel or background contrast. Red and blue channels show low contrast and are very noisy compared to the green channel. Hence we extract the green channel. The extracted green channel is inverted before application to wavelet transform so that the vessels appear brighter than the background. For feature extraction GABA wavelets is used. It can detect vessels in any orientation, position and scale. GABA wavelet transform is computed for theta spanning from 0 degree up to 170 degree at steps of 10 degree and the maximum is taken. In SVM segmentation, the SVM finds the hyperplane that causes the largest separation between the decision function values for the borderline. In RVM segmentation, a machine learning technique that uses Bayesian interface is used to obtain the parsimonious solution for regression and classification. From the results obtained from SVM segmentation and RVM segmentation by computing the sensitivity, specificity and accuracy, we can conclude that the SVM gives better result than RVM. But SVM takes larger time for computation. Now we will see the demo of this project. Right click on retinal segmentation main.m file and select run file. Click on green channel extraction button and you can select any images from the images folder and click open button. So this is the corresponding red, green and blue channels extracted from the original color image and here we consider only the green channel because red and blue show low contrast and are very noisy when compared to the green channel. Next we apply green channel inversion before application to wavelet transform so that the vessels they appear brighter than the background and this is the corresponding histogram for the green channel and the inverted green channel. 
feature extraction based on gap wavelet transfer is done and these outputs are the GABA wavelet transform computed for theta spanning from 0 degrees up to 170 degree at steps of 10 degrees. Next SVM segmentation. This process takes time as it has to find the hyperplane that causes the largest separation between the decision function values for the borderline. So here we have obtained the RBF interpolation kernel width graphs for different kernel width sizes 0 0.25, 0 0.5, 0 0.75, 0 0.75, 0 0.75, 0 0.75 and 1. So this is the segmentation result of SVM using various kernel widths. This is the ISO surface visualization of kernel widths 0 0.25, 0 0.5, 0 0.75 and 1. Next is segmentation using RVM and here we have obtained the RVM result and this is the SVM result and this is the input image we have selected. And next is the performance measures. Here we calculate sensitivity, specificity and accuracy. And from this we can conclude that SVM gives better result than RVM. But SVM takes larger time for computation when compared to RVM. Thank you.